my hair is so long, but that don't matter because happy Gout Awareness Day. Guess what? Let's talk about gout, aka the king's disease, aka I got royalty in my blood. It's because we've been eating good, we've been drinking good, and I'll quote Outcast: "My shit don't stink." But lean a little bit closer, and I'll tell you more about it. So, what is gout? Well, gout does definitely affect everyone. It affects a lot of people. However, everyone produces it. Men, women, children, they produce uric acid in their body. Now, it's a body waste byproduct and your kidneys will eliminate it. But here's the drama about being in the royal family. Uh, you're always gonna have to go to war because it's gout. So common places that it will attack is, number one, your big toe. Number two, your ankles. And number three, your knee. So those are the three common places that it generally attacks. So here's the thing. These uric crystals are gonna build up in your joints and it's gonna fuck you up. No, seriously, it will. Now it's so painful that any movement, the wind blowing, the one sheet on your foot, and any movement will force you to clench your asshole and take it like a champion. That's how much it hurts. Here's the thing, it gets so bad that you need to go to the emergency room and get the forbidden fruit punch drained out of your knee. But here's the thing, gout doesn't give a fuck about your body type. I'm out here trying to look like a, a snack. So here's the thing, even if you're the thickest, the juiciest individual, most people will arrive in Gout City in first class. Although it does affect more men than women. So ladies, no need to explore Gout City. So when you officially arrive in Gout City, uh, you usually will visit uh, Limp City. And it's mandatory and bylaw to walk like you got scoliosis. And you're usually swerving people like, ugh, ugh. So that's how you have to walk there. Next stop is Crutch City, uh, which is where I'm at right now. Um, it's a strange place because the currency used here is your lats. So your shoulders gotta be up, back, and down. So that way you got big lats when you're in Crutch City. So most people ask, oh, hey, Wilson, how long do you usually uh, visit Gout City? Well, it depends. Now, if you're balling out of control, right and you're eating good again drinking good again you're gonna visit gout city about four to six times a year and that's a little too much for me uh, i usually visit once a year uh but for about three to four weeks which even for me is a little bit too long and when you do visit here there's a couple foods that you won't find uh there's no red meats there's no liquor there's no shellfish because these are high purine foods and it's gonna spark that uric acid to build up again and you don't want that when you're leaving goat city or else you're returning if you want to leave goat city you got to be best friends with your drug dealer and by drug dealer i mean your pharmacist now i ain't no medical professional but i did do english 30-2 so i swear i can read so the first drug of choice that you're gonna have to take is endomethacin um, you got to dig one capsule three times a day the next one is my favorite it's coochizine and you got to take two times a day and you can combine these two bad boys together and last but not least men you got to wrap your shit or else you're gonna have to take pregnant zone uh, and y'all don't want to go to pregnant zone now, this is the one drug that I don't have to take because I don't go to Gout City four to six times a year, and it is called allopurinol. And that one you don't want to take because you have to take it every day for the rest of your life. So, uh, I'm taking the first two, endomethacin, colchizine. Other than that, so I hope y'all learned a little bit of uh, about gout, and because it's Gout Awareness Day, definitely wanted to share that with you. So, if you're out there with that sexy mobility of yours, that appetite, please, today, run a little bit more. Eat that extra one ounce steak. Add that extra pint for the homies. So, if you're out there with gout right now, I feel y'all. I totally understand where you're coming from. And here's the thing, everyone else, if you are into big toe zaddy and you want feet pictures, it's 25 bucks. No. <laughs> um, yeah, other than that, have a beautiful gut awareness day. Take care.